You cannot protect yourself from sadness without protecting yourself from happiness. Tears come from the heart and not from the brain. To have felt too much is to end in feeling nothing. People keep telling me that life goes on, but to me that's the saddest part. To me life never ends. When you go to war as a boy, you have a great illusion of immortality. Other people get killed, not you. Then, when you are badly wounded the first time, you lose that illusion, and you know it can happen to you. But to me, I wish I could have that feeling. This is the story of me. Who am I? How did I end up like this? What's keeping me away from only thing that I ever wanted? Come join with me. Hear my story. Let's go back in time. A journey of a thousand miles begins with a single step. A baby is like the beginning of all things, wonder, hope, and a dream of possibilities. With all these, the day came, the day that I was born. The day that I was destined to be special forever. Is it my destiny? I don't know. Am I special? I don't know. Will I be a burden to everyone? I don't know. All these questions came into life the day I was born. No, this is not me. But I am like this bird. He is free to go anywhere he wanted to go. And so am I. I had all the time in the world to do anything I want. Yes. This is me. My name is Du. Yes. I am a mammoth. A mammoth that is destined to do great things. Life is a journey filled with unexpected miracles. I have stories to tell, stories that provide wisdom about the journey of my life. This thing we call life is not a destination with an end for me. Why? I don't know. My parents kept me safe all their life. I was too scared to see the world. The world I was born into. Everything felt like endless for me. That feeling kept me away from everything for a long time. If there is a question that has no answer, then that question probably is my life. I want to find the meaning of this life. This is the start of my journey.
Hi. This is me. My name is Duke. Duke means the leader. So from the day I was born, everyone expected so much from me. Sometimes it was overwhelming for me. But, for some time no one didn't know what's so special about me. Yeah, even for me, I did not know about it. I was just as normal as others. Just like that, most peaceful time in my whole life just ended like a lightning. And one day something happened, and it changed my life forever. That day everyone realized how different I am, and what's so special about me. Yeah, that day I was playing with my friend, and we had a great time playing. But out of nowhere, we were ambushed. We were attacked by a pack of saber-toothed tigers. The moment I saw them, I knew that this was the end of me. Even our parents had no time to come for us, because they were so far away from us. My friend got badly injured. Unfortunately his life ended that day. I was shocked seeing that. I too had so many wounds all over my body. But something felt different for me. I didn't felt anything. But how? I should be dead by then. But I was alive for some reason. But what? I had lot of wounds. But I did not feel any pain. By then our whole group of mammoths came to rescue us. And they crushed all of those tigers. Everyone were surprised to see me alive. And at the same time they were sad about my friend who lost his life. But that day, I realized something. That is, death is not an option for me. Realizing the specialty of me, I was so happy. I mean who wouldn't be? I could do anything I want to without a fear. Well, I was small by then. So I did not understand the consequences of this. Still I wanted to confirm it one more time, because I was curious. So I started to mess with the biggest group of bisons in the land. around. So, one day, I let all of them trample me.
Even though I was trampled to death, even though I got wounded badly, I did not feel anything at all. I wondered what happened to me. Who can explain about this miracle? Yes, it was a miracle.